to be a dragon, you gotta be strong, humble, never bragging. Always fight for right, battling wrong with the power of the dragon. Never intentionally harm another. Do not battle if you can avoid it. Jimmy and Billy Lee are Dragon Masters now. Dragon Master was born with the mark of the double dragon. in the Dragon Temple below Undertown, and I've just uncovered an ancient artifact so magnificent, you, you have to see it for yourselves. <laughs> we read you, Dr. Lindquist. We're on our way. Unfortunately, Dragon Masters, you'll be too late. I wonder what Dr. Lindquist found. No! Huh? I won't let you take it! Stop! No! No! Fearing meddler. Play with dragons and you're bound to get burned. Mess with shadows and you're going to get iced. What? Enough, Dragon Masters. Make your choice. Surrender the sword to me. Or bid your foolish friend farewell. Bro, catch! <laughs> <laughs> Can't have that sword. No one shall. I took most of my power, but it's worth it. Behold your magnificent sword, dragon. What a waste! A priceless dragon artifact. Ruined. Maybe not, Doc. Look! Even in defeat, this noble sword retains the spirit of the dragon. Billy and Jimmy were right. This metal is special. Non-magnetic, non-nuclear resonant, completely impervious to subionic forces. Yeah? It'll make a perfect addition to the shielding for the Dragon Copter's central control module. Uh, pull out the blueprints, will you? Uh, the central control module? That one, look, right there, see? It's written right there. Oh, yeah, right. I don't know how I missed it. Hmm. Man, I don't know what I'm doing. But if I tell Chop I can't read, he'll boot me out of the shop. Nah, any real mechanic ought to be able to figure this stuff out. How hard can it be? Welcome to Metro Center, designed to rejuvenate our inner city. On our tour, we'll be seeing our low-income housing wreck areas, where Billy Lee will continue his valuable work with the local kids. Our experimental school, including adult education facilities. And our computer automated factory, which can produce state-of-the-art vehicles in record time. 
None of this would exist if it were not for our own Mrs. Chadwick's generous support. Thank you. You know I'm also an amateur bird watcher. But for the life of me, I can't figure out what kind of birds those are circling our center. Quickly, you must all leave immediately. Because of a few birds? Birds of prey, shadow warriors. Nice bird. Take your squad and seize control of the factory. Secure the roof. I want no interference. Understand. Disarm the guards. Seize as many hostages as possible. Stand guard while I reprogram the central computer for the Shadow Flame! <gasps> Everyone down! Billy, look out! Ugh. Clear the building, now! Get as far away as you can! Billy, Mrs. Chadwick isn't here! If those shadow brutes get their hands on that poor old lady... They'll answer to me. How dare you ruffians break into our center! Oh, the police will incarcerate you for a long time for this! Forget it, Grandma! Ow! Uh, the police aren't coming! Oh, uh, we told them to back off a... a or else you're going to get it! That's smart. Bring the elderly one to me. Elderly one? Where is this insolent shadow person? I'll show him elderly. That's your service, madam. Allow me to thank you for the generous use of your family. What? What? Never. To produce the ultimate flying attack vehicle, the Shadow Flame, I shall create an entire fleet of them, and thus will become invincible. Jimmy, do you read me? We've got a shadow situation at Metro Center. Yeah, I hear you, bro. We're taking the Dragon Copter up for its maiden flight. And a little rumble with the shadow sounds like a great way to break this baby in. Don't worry. I got your sword. Be careful. The Shadow Master's taken a hostage. Okay, Vortex. Hold her on course and let the computer handle tactical of flight. You'll be... Whoa! Vortex, what's happening? The, the onboard computer just tell us what's wrong. What is wrong is that I am no longer in the form of a sword. And the misbegotten wealth will put me in this flying rickshaw. Did it all wrong. My G is completely misdirected. Oh no! Didn't you follow the blueprints, Vortex? Yeah, uh, yeah, of course. Then why did the computer say it's all wrong? Computer, I am Dalum, Dragon Spirit of the Sword of Chen Long, ancient warrior master. Together, we vanquished many shadows. To be imprisoned within this pony cart is a grave humiliation for a weapon such as I. Hey, the Dragon Copter happens to be the most powerful weapon in our arsenal, you cybernetic... Whoa, whoa, pull up! Whoa! Then this is not a punishment. I should not consider this a disgrace. Look, will you take the word of a Dragon Master, pal? You got more shadow fighting power now than a hundred swords. Ah, oh, a thousand pardons. Fortunately, it is a simple matter. <laughs> to reverse the flow of chi which this young bungler has misdirected. Oh, Way to go, oh, Dragon! All right. Okay, Vortex, switch to manual. We got a date in the Metro Center. At last! The first Shadow Flame is completed! Now can we get rid of our master, please? Ouch! Listen, Mr. Toothpick. I speak. I speak. Your manners are abominable. I'm going to... Madam, I have decided to honor you appropriately. And high time 
to? By inviting you to help us test the weapon system of the Shadow Flame. What? Oh, you don't mean... That's right. Target practice. Jimmy, are you there? You've got to come in now. Tenth floor, south side. Hurry! Okay, Dragon Spirit. We'll bust right through that dome. I have a much better strategy, old Dragon Master. No time for debate. Chop, let's rumble. Detach pods and follow me in. Affirmative. Jimmy, I'm hit. Yeah, join the club. Hang on. Set her down so I can calibrate my sights. Ah, perfect. Forget it, Shadow Master! Oh, no. The lady's decided it's time to leave. I can live with that. The question is, can you? It is I, Da Lung. This huh? Vortex is still a babe in the cradle. He couldn't save a duck. Excuse me? Who are you? Can't save a duck, huh? You take a lesson, Big Mouth. <laughs> Surprise! Powers such as these, I could have defeated the hordes of Genghis Khan single-handed. I guess. You okay, dude? Uh, yeah. But who dropped the engine block on my head? Oh. Ah, Jimmy Lee. A far more entertaining target than that nuisance brother of yours. Come along, you old bag. No! Who are you calling an old bag? <gasps> oh, get back here, you miserable old... <laughs> <laughs> Too, if you guys don't step on it. Hang on, bro. And even better. I think this belongs to you. Or money! Or right! We are double dragons! I am Vortex, Dragon Warrior! Shadowmaster's holding Mrs. Chadwick hostage on the top floor. Then let's trash these suckers! Dragons, go! I sense the darkness. 
Prince of Shadow. At last, an enemy worthy of my blade. Blasters might be more appropriate. Yes, I see your point. I would be honored if you would join me in this battle. The honor is ours, but whom do we have the honor of speaking to? A long story, bro. A billion later. We got company. Let us instruct the Shadow Master in the way of the dragon. Hold on. Three more seconds. Now, hit your thrusters! No! He scores! Slam dunked him! Uh, pardon me, sire, but slam what? Can see you need some educating, Dragon Spirit, dude. Dude? Game's not over yet, guys. Look! Listen up, dragons! Mrs. Chatterbox here is my prisoner! Surrender or else. Or else? What? Ah! You sociopath. No, not again. Well, she hardly needs saving. But what do you say, bro? Let's do it. Dragon Spirit Vortex, can you two handle things here? Yes, Dragon Master. No problem. to your elders, Ice Pick. Yeah, learn some manners. Are you all right, ma'am? Of course, young man. But your friends aren't. Wait here, Mrs. Chadwick. We'll be right back! There is no escape for you now, dragons. Are you quite sure about this plan, youngster? You gotta trust me on this dragon spirit. And the name is Vortex. But the bait is still mine. <laughs> like a rat in a trap. Curse you, dragons! <laughs> I shall return, dragons. Then you shall come to dread the name of the Shadow Flame. Any sign yet of Mrs. Chadwick? No, nope. we've checked each floor, but we'll keep looking. So, Dragon Spirit, still sorry you're not a sword? It is not so bad being a copter with a pilot who has skills and courage such as yours, Vortex. Hey, <laughs> well, thanks. Which makes me wonder, why did you do such a poor job assembling me? Well, the truth is, I can't read, okay? But how can we discuss the wisdom of the ancient Dragon Masters if you cannot read their words? I... I don't know. My master, Chen Long, would say, with all the energy that you waste pretending to be what you are not, you could become what you want to be a hundred times over. You mean, quit faking it? In fewer words, yes. And perhaps we can help each other, young warrior. You got it, Dragon Spirit. Hey, there she is! Yo, Dragons, we found Mrs. Chadwick! 
She's behind that rock. Mrs. Chadwick, are you all right? Why, of course. But where is everyone? It's all over? Oh, what a shame. I was having a simply glorious time. The most fun I've had in years. When I miswired the dragon copter because I couldn't read the instructions, I put everyone's life in danger. We were never in danger. Not with me there. Right. Now that I've started learning to read, a whole new world's opened up for me. And I feel good about myself. Perfect. Oh, yeah. And now I'm an ace mechanic. Huh? You were saying. Thanks, Motormouth. <laughs>